Remember our conversation about measuring success? We'd like to share with you now how we are measuring our success with the group in San Marcos La Laguna. Our goal of forming creative and informed leaders in sustainable development can be subdivided into three objectives. To build consensus among an intercultural group. Use a collaborative methodology to design an innovative solution that improves the quality of life in the town. Develop a clear and complete logical framework detailing the long-term vision, the why, and the mid-term mission, what, and a detailed action plan, how. The first objective can be verified by reviewing the number of decisions made by the group, all of which were unanimous. Likewise, the majority of the participants maintained their attendance at all the meetings, demonstrating their investment in the process. One other indicator is that one of the success criteria they chose, even before coming to a solution, was a commitment to consensus. The second objective is in the process of being verified. For the moment, the solution has been expressed clearly. Create a cooperative that produces and sells products with local elements, wisdom materials and processes, that incorporates innovative elements, making them locally and globally marketable. Work has begun to move it forward. This is somewhat harder to verify than the first goal, so we have gathered observational as well as quantitative evidence. At first it was impossible for the group to think through and plan out their action steps. One meeting ended somewhat tensely as we all left with a clear idea of what we were going to do, but no clear plan as to how to do it. This is probably due to the cultural divides, including language barriers and a widely varied amount of formal education. In spite of these doubts, pineapple, bananas, tomatoes, and beef jerky are consistently being prepared in Konohel's solar dehydrate. The first sale at a harvest festival in town brought in enough profit to pay the members of the cooperative for their hours worked and reinvest in order to purchase more product. The group continues to meet once or twice per week and they are currently organizing themselves internally and improving their production and sales. After completing the prototype sale, they gathered important information about demand and have been able to clearly describe all the action steps and identify some opportunities for improvement. The next sale will be part of a local telethon held in support of Konohel Community Center, shortly followed by a three-day international music festival across the lake in Santiago Atitlan. The third objective has proven difficult given the enormous diversity of the group. However, making use of the information gathered throughout the PAPI process, the construction of a theoretical framework has begun. 